morning everyone. I've actually been up for quite some time. I think I'm about 6 o'clock this morning. Just now watching YouTube. Wasn't feeling too bad. And then I took the full dose of Lyrica today, which is my pain medication. So I'm not in really much pain. Just very mild. I mean, my hands and feet still hurt slightly, but compared to yesterday, I feel pretty good. But <laughs> the Lyrica makes me feel a bit lightheaded and woozy, which I kind of expected. And it's still better than being in so much pain. So but it could just be a good day. I'm not really quite sure. But anyway, I'm going to take the Lyrica for the full strength for a few days. And after a few days, it should be over the um, lightheadedness. And then hopefully not much pain either. And I'll be able to sort of get it back to normal because I haven't really done hardly anything since we come home from holidays. Just little, bit, little bits and pieces as I've been able to. But I have spent some time, well, probably the last hour, working on our new, new bit working on our visit to Nimea. So there's lots of music in that video, so I hope that's okay, but um, a lot of wind in the microphone on the train and stuff, so no lot of choice. It's a gorgeous day out, look, I'll show you. Beautiful day out there. Kevin's still got to put away the barbecue stuff from two days ago, and obviously his entails to go away, but it just looks lovely out there today. We're probably going up to gold class, I think, to see, what's the movie we're seeing, Kevin? What's the movie that we're seeing? The Imitation Game, which is about, what's his name? Alan Turing. Alan Turing, Turing yeah. No, you might remember Athena did an assignment on him this year. I think I showed it on vlogs. If you've been watching for a while, you might remember that. <laughs> um, so Kevin, Kevin and Athena in particular are very keen to go see that. And they want to go see in gold class up in Sydney. So I think there's a session at about quarter past six. So I'll probably go up for that because we did find that voucher. Remember, it's got used by February for Kevin's birthday. I can't remember if I mentioned that Kevin took the doggies on a walk this morning. But they're pretty pooped. You're cute, Bailey. <laughs> well, your doggies do think you're human, don't you? Here's the other precious one. <coughs> Funny doggies. As you can see, Bailey's still a big itchy spot. Maybe your pat him, he starts going. <laughs> He's so strange. I don't really, there it goes. I don't really want to say good. Look how far he's gone. <laughs> oh, we got the lickies as well. We got the lickies as well. Oh dear. So good. So good. <laughs> Poor fella. Oh, I mean, it's one last thing. I was just thinking, something I need to tell you too. Oh, I found one of my chickens dead yesterday. It was actually a noisy Nancy. And you got there now, it's so quiet. I thought you woke up Lucy yesterday, but she was alright when I went out and found Nancy dead. So, poor old girl. I think she might have been close to eight. So, I would think that's pretty old for a chicken. The other two, they're probably at six, I think. I'm not quite sure which lot they were from. I know Nancy was from the second lot who had a lot of dark red sort of chickens. So we're down to two now. So that was going to happen when we get down to one. Like one chicken by itself. I think that'd be pretty lonely. <sighs> Dear, I might try and get that dealt with today. Well, I decided the best way to um, make sure I went for a swim with my swimming cosies on. So I've got them on under this dress. That way, <laughs> I'll be reminded to go have a swim and spend some time out in the sun. Which should be nice because uh, since I've been home, I've been out by the pool once and that was when the powers were over for New Year's Day. I didn't get to lie in the sun. We were in the pool for a long time and that was nice. Um, I just wanted to try and tackle some of these boxes before I go downstairs. Not really in the mood for tidying. I'm still a bit sort of woozy in the head. I might pack up the last stuff downstairs and bring that, or put that to bring upstairs and then when they're up here, I'll put them all the way together, I think. That'd be the best thing. I think it might be time for another cup of tea. <laughs> just say it's a lovely day. Blue skies, no clouds. It's nice in the air conditioning anyway. I mentioned it's pretty hot out there. Yeah, I'm not going to do too much today because I'm going to try and treat this as, as it is the weekend and the last of the sort of holidays with Kevin here. And I wonder he goes back to work. So then hopefully my medication will have kicked in and then I can get into sort of a normal routine. Do need to clean the house. The cleaners don't come back. To Monday week and it's already been we almost three weeks since the house has been cleaned and there's also sort of like insects little baby cockroaches or small cockroaches and stuff around obviously died off from our 
stuff that we have for spray, house spray, but it's lots of dead insects around. <laughs> so I did vacuum downstairs the other day, but we've got more again. I need to, and absolutely need a really good vacuum, toilets and cleaned. I'll see if I can get the girls on board and the house tidied. I think I've got friends coming over Monday. I'm not sure what time, but hopefully they'll have enough time to give me a hand in the morning and sort of whip the house back into shape a bit and then I can just sort of keep on top of it, hopefully feeling well enough to do so. Before I sit down and do my cup of tea, I'm going to quickly transform this. I've already bought, bought the box down, but just about swapping it over. Here we go, all done. Looks nice and sort of summery, I think. Tropical. Maybe I'll swap the family and the photos and see if that looks any better. I don't know. What do you think looks better? I'm kind of liking that minimalist look. Let me know. I'm not really sure about this at the minute. I don't really like having that big dish because I know that Kevin will just dump everything in it, but he kind of needs somewhere to dump things as well, or things he wants to take to work the next day. So if it just has things to and from on a daily basis, it'd be okay. Let me know whether I should add these things, the family sign and the photo back in. For the moment, I'll put them back under the stairs with all the other stuff. All the other display stuff goes in here. <laughs> I'll pop it in here. Need to. I did start and film part of this cupboard. Look, I didn't do that. I did that. <laughs> I need to go through and um, donate some items. And then I'll put the whole video together and film it for you. This cute little girl. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> Oh, it's been a hard morning, hasn't it, darling? Oh, he's so cute. So I'm going to take some lunch. Got my video up finally. I still want to try and get another one edited. I do that after lunch. So the plan is I'm going to do lunch. I'm going to make taco salads. I've still got some leftover salad from Year's Day. And I've got enough to make taco salads anyway. <laughs> the fridge is still, look at it. It's a very bare. Very bare fridge. So I've got some salad and I think there's still some more lettuce and oh yeah, I'm sure better just eke out enough for a taco salad. So I'm just boil the kill and I have to do the TVP mints. And then I think Karen's gonna have a sleep. So I might um edit another video while he does that. Watch a bit of YouTube. I'm behind in my blog post again because I've entered the password wrong and they sort of shut me out now. So um Try to get that fixed, but he's got to do it for me. I want to do my word for the year. Get that done. Um, but I can't do it until he does that, as I said. We've decided just to go to the local movie theatre, which is good. We got tickets were like $11 each instead of $35. So a bit of a savings, <laughs> just a little bit. And then we're going at 7 o'clock, so we'll leave here about 6 30 ish to get to the movies. Okay, fridge. Just getting everything out that I need. To make these taco salads, I'll show you when it's all done. Taco salads for everyone. Yes, Yummy. What did you just do, Fuzzle? I just saw him pulling out chunks of fluff. What did you pull that out for? I don't know why he pulled out that bit of fluff, and he's pulled out more there. Fuzzy, why did you pull out your fluff? I know you've got sores. And when the sores like come off the skin, I usually try and pull them off because he will do that. I've seen him do that. He tries to pull them out himself. And if I do it, I don't pull out the fur. <laughs> I've been trying to attend to your sores, but most of them have still been stuck on your skin. Poor Fuzzy. Hey. You're so cute. Well, I've been going to go out by the pool, but um, I think I need to tackle some ironing. <laughs> Don't you think? I've even started another pile under there somewhere. Oh, that's right. I think I came looking for a tablecloth the other day. That's the destruction. I'll do a half an hour and then I'll go out by the pool. Well, I don't think I got very far, but I got, oh, I don't go very far, but I got all the clothes that were hanging down, but obviously my basket's still full. <laughs> And um, yeah, so you can see Kevin's t shirts a couple for me. There's mainly Athena's clothes. I think Athena's in Kevin's t shirts, probably from the cruise. 
So that's all Christie's clothes from the crew, her dresses and stuff. So I'll try and do a bit more. I'll try and do a bit each day, I think, when I'm feeling good. Probably should do some more, but I really want to go up by the pool. Um, and it's really hot in here. I'm actually sweating. <laughs> Even though I've got, well, there's no air conditioning in this room. So in the house there is, but not in here. But I want to go up by the pool. It's pretty windy out there, though, so I hope it's still nice. And try another vlog. Kevin just found out he's going to work tomorrow. So fingers crossed I feel good and I'd like to do a bit of hunting, a bit more editing, a bit more watching, and um, put all this Christmas stuff away upstairs. Maybe I'll get it tomorrow. Um, get a head start on Monday. I made it out by the pool, but it is indeed rather windy. So I don't. Not quite as nice as it could have been now. And it's still nice and warm, so I'll fly for a little bit. It's a bit of vitamin D, and I'll, if I get warm enough, I'll go for a swim. That's crazy, because it's warm but windy. I'll probably go for a swim after. I've got my loyal doggy beside me because she's so hot. What a loyal puppy you are, Rose. Oh, you're so hot, darling. I quite like lying in the sun, though, sometimes. <laughs> The unusual goldens won't go in the pool. Most goldies will go in the pool. There's so many else, like you, Rose. back to normal to some extent. Okay. How you doing girl? Okay. How is that Mr. Bailey? No worries. Don't shake near me, I've got the camera. Eh. Oh, it's oh it's wet. Fuzzy. Isn't it because they both fell in when we first got them? Well, for all the trauma of that swim, Rosie, I come inside and Rosie's rolling on the back. She's stopped now, of course. But no, I'm not going to admit to doing that. <laughs> how was it, Rosie? We tried to... We keep reading how good swimming is such good exercise for dogs. But I don't know if Christy explained or not. But both of these dogs, we got them obviously on different days, years apart. The first day that both of them come home to our house, they walked around the, fell and pool, around the pool and fell in. That's why they have never been keen on the pool. They're golden retrievers. They love to swim, especially Rosie. She'll go in the lake, the river, the ocean. He will too, especially to paddle. But they're just scared of our pool. Which is sad because it would be so good for you to swim. My other goldie swam in the pool. So I might just go and get little paddling pools or something. Maybe they'll just paddle in it. Unless we can work out a way to get them to go into the pool because they would love it. I see goldies all the time. I see on Instagram photos of goldies jumping in this pool and swimming. And that's what I keep thinking of it that we should try it. Plus, you keep hearing it's such a good exercise for them to swim. Hey, you weren't very cooperative, were you, Fuzzy? I've got scratches on my legs. Kevin's got a big scratch on his chest. Because <laughs> I don't know if Chrissy filmed, he really freaked out when we tried to get him to swim at the pool. He was going like sideways. Don't know what he was doing. Like his whole body was going so like he was going to try and drown himself. It was very bizarre. But Kevin managed to get, well, particularly Rose would go and take food off him while he was still in the pool. So she's not too scared to go up to someone in the pool. He's still a bit nervous. But hopefully, you know, I don't know. Huh. Might have to admit defeat or we might just try again. Maybe try and read if anyone's got any tips on how to get puppies who are scared of the water? I know I said on Caesar before, but at the time Kevin didn't want them to swim. But now he's decided they could swim. So that's why I ran inside and he said okay to get treats to try it. So what are we playing, Christy? We're doing the Disney challenge. 
That is new challenge, but not officially. We're just doing it at home. That's fun. Can I use down here? It's just Kevin. No. Now you have to close your computer. Close. I'm closing. Close your computer, Mr. Withnor. <laughs> okay, when did Dad close his computer? Daddy. Didn't know. Oh, I thought I'll run over the game. We're not going to let <laughs> Miss Athena play because we're two questions and she's already grabbed the first two questions. Okay, the, you need to listen The then. second one, she only got the few, first few notes of it and got it. Let's get this one. We'll film this. Ready? Real All right. Evidence. I guess it's a fairly easy one, so. Pressure's on. <laughs> That's me in the room. <laughs> <laughs> Pressure is on. Betty. Uh, I won't say I'm in love for Hercules. Yeah, there's no like point us playing, Kevin. I've already seen Hercules once. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've said a few well, times. Well, I think I have a five second penalty. What? Right. When you play songs, you have a five second penalty. So you have to wait five seconds until you can name the song. What? I'm being punished now. I'm being too good. <laughs> so, you, so you guys have five seconds where she can't say the name of the song. Oh, you. okay. So you guys have more of a chance of actually getting something. Right. Time no. also very, very I don't make any no, difference. No, I'll, 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 I'll... Is that noisy with my... Athena won, so we're not going to invite her next time. <laughs> She's watched too many Disney movies. Oh, who showed me these movies? Yeah. Who was actually at fault here, Mother? Not at fault. you got to credit me. Not at fault for you. <laughs> I'm to thank introducing to Disney movies. That was a fun little trip down memory lane playing guess the Disney songs and remembering a couple of trips we took down the coast. One we played High School Musical all the way down, another one we played Brother Bear all the way down. So yeah it was fun. My face was very shiny. I didn't put any makeup on. I just have a lipstick. I just um put my hair back. All right, I can probably guess black pants, see some top that I wore on New Year's Christmas Eve and I'll just put the white single top white jacket on over the top because this is a bit cool in the movie theatre I probably need it outside, I'll take it off probably we're going to leave soon have some subway before we go into the movies and then we just grab a drink and probably hungry after that if someone wants something get something in the movie um, Kevin will probably want a choc top <laughs> I was supposed to film me sneak up behind the camera, that's what happens you get a lovely close up shot of Kevin Ridiculous. He's sticking his tongue out at me like a two-year-old. That's why it was a bit offended when he read that I'd written my little description on every video. It says I've got two teenagers, three to count him. Proof. He's my biggest child. Anyway, I'm going to while I wait for Athena. I'll quickly tidy up, stack the dishwasher. Chrissy's not coming. The movie be too old for her. She wouldn't be really interested. Not that she even asked what we're going to see. She likes being at home. She didn't even ask what we're going to see. <laughs> She's taking the dogs next door, so we've still got to... I know they have a lot of biscuits out by the pool, so they probably, if they don't get dinner, it probably won't matter. So anyway, it's warm in here because the air conditioning's turned up so we don't freeze in the lounge room. I'll quickly do this Subway to go when it's time. I'm just getting our lunch and dinner in Subway. I'm having my usual veggie patty wrap. We're well, back from the movie. It was really, really good. Really enjoyed it. Um, I think it's the kind of movie that I'm not into computers so much, but yeah, it's a good movie. I encourage you to go see it. Very, very good. Um, Benedict Cumberbatch, which was really, was really good in the movie. Yes, no, we all enjoyed it. <laughs> that was really good. As a Kevin's read the book um, that the movie's based on, and obviously Athena had studied him for her assignment. And here is little movie. We didn't come to the movie with us. I was hugging Fuzzy. Yes. Anyway, I will say good night. I think I've forgotten to sign off a bit lately, but um, yeah. See you guys. Not sure when. I need to try and have a few days off vlogging so I can get caught up because I'm still like 10 days behind. I'd like to get back onto like a day or two, at least a day, two days maybe behind reality. Um, so, hey, Christy, <laughs> in the video. I don't care. There's dog hair in my mouth. Lovely. Fuzzy. I have to edit that out and we say goodnight again because, oh, Chrissy, stop it. You're being silly. Okay, I'll say goodnight again and I will see you guys very soon. Night.